Begin reading your task. Begin. Hi, Mr. Davidson. Hello. Please, give me something for this pain. It hurts. Okay, it no worries, hurts. no worries. My name is Dr. Raza, one of the doctors in the department, and I'm called because you are in pain. Uh, please let me know where exactly the pain is. It's in my stomach. Okay, okay. Is it where you had the operation? Yes. Okay, no worries. I'll, I'll have a look on that. Um, is the pain getting worse? It's slightly better after the operation, but it's still in much pain now. Okay, okay. Is it going somewhere else? No. Okay, do you have any other symptoms? No, this is just pain. Okay, okay. Let me quickly examine you, then I'll talk about and we'll give you something to control the pain. Let me check your oxygen level, please. Okay, um, your oxygen is 98%. Um, are you feeling any lump in the throat, any difficulty in breathing? No. Okay, let me have a look into your throat. There is no problem. I'm happy with that. So your oxygen looks okay to me. Um, I'm going to feel your neck and examine your chest. Is that okay? Okay. Okay. It's like a centre located. Okay. I'm going to expose your chest a bit, okay? Take deep breath in and out. Okay. Very good. Any pain in the chest? No. Okay. Deep breath in and out. And again. Very good. Okay. I'm going to listen to your chest. And again. Deep breath in and out. And again. Thank you. Let me check your uh, breathing rate. All right, you are breathing a bit fast, Mr. Davidson. Please don't you worry. Um, this is likely because you have the pain. I will have a look onto that shortly, okay? Let me feel your fingers. I'm going to pinch. One, two, three, four, five. Capillary refill time is one second. Okay, so you are well hydrated. Uh, did you eat or drink after you came uh, from the operation? No, I didn't do that. Okay, let me feel your pulses. Nice. Okay, and uh, pulses in the feet. Bowel Okay, very good. You got very good pulses, so I'm not worried about um, about anything at the moment. I'm gonna feel your tummy a bit. Okay, uh, for that I need to expose you. Is that okay? Okay. Thank you. All right, I can see the dressing, and uh, that looks okay to me. Um, is it where you are feeling pain? Yes. Okay, okay. Um, so I'm happy with that. Your tummy seems soft. Okay, very good. I'm going to, exp to cover you and um, you're not feeling sick, are you? No. Okay, no worries. Did you eat or drink after you came from the hospital, uh, from operation theater? No, I didn't. Okay. I think uh, it will be a good idea if I keep you uh, nil by mouth at the moment, give you some fluid. I'm happy with the numbers. Let me check your blood pressure. Okay, your blood pressure is also high. Uh, again, likely because of the pain. So uh, you'll feel better. Uh, are you allergic to any medications? No. Okay. I will give you paracetamol to start with. 
regularly and uh, I will give you morphine if needed okay before uh, I do that let me check your drug chart okay and see uh, your medications okay so you have Mr. Davidson and you are 67 years old okay On the regular medications, uh, you do not have uh, any painkiller prescribed. Okay. So, Mr. Davidson, you do not have any prescription regular for the pain control. Okay. I will give you paracetamol regular four times daily. Okay. In the beginning, I will give you intravenously. And as you start feeling better and you're able to drink, then uh, drink and swallow, then I'll give you. Um, oral medication okay and I will also prescribe you morphine is that okay yes okay so uh, let me continue examination do you know where you are yes I'm in the hospital okay okay very good um, let me show you bright light into the eyes how are your pupils doing bilaterally reactive 3.5 millimeter in diameter okay Okay, I'm happy with that. Uh, let me check your glucose, sugar level. Are you diabetic? No. Okay. Uh, the glucose is... Glucose level is 6.5 millimole per liter. Okay. I've already examined you and I could see um, on, um, on exposure your catheter is uh, uh, fine. So, uh, Mr. Davidson... This pain is quite expected after the operation. Very likely it will get better as the time goes by. Okay, I will make sure that you prescribe the regular medications. There are a few things that I want you to be aware of, please. Okay, uh, please let the nurse know if your pain continues getting worse. Two minutes if remaining. If you don't feel better, okay? Or if you develop any other symptoms in addition to the pain, like if you start feeling nausea or you start vomiting, Please let the nurse know. I will come and see you. Do you have any question? No, thank okay. you. Okay, okay. Let me check your numbers again. I'm still here. Okay, your pulse is uh, getting better. The blood pressure is um, coming back to normal. Uh, Mr. Davidson, how are you feeling now? Yeah, I'm feeling much better now. Okay, okay, very good. I'm really glad with that. Okay. Um, I will uh, prescribe you, give you the fluid as well because uh, you, you just returned from the operation theater. Okay. Um, I will give you one liter saline. It is mainly to keep you hydrated. Okay. I'm not worried about uh, your uh, uh, blood pressure otherwise. Okay. So once you start feeling better, we will do the assessment on your swallowing and if you're able to eat and drink, then we will start regular medications and stop this IV fluid. Is that okay? Okay. All right, thank you. Just keep an eye on your symptoms. Let the nurse know. I'm happy with the numbers that I can see. Uh, your pulse rate is uh, very good now. The blood pressure is normal. Uh, oxygen saturation and temperature 37.2. Everything is under control, Mr. Davidson, okay? Please don't you worry, I'm around. Move on to the next station.